A major challenge in managing extensive natural disasters is the fast and comprehensive reconnaissance of the actual situation. This is exemplified by an industrial plant where fire has broken out and is spreading over the building. Parts of the building treat to collapse and break into pieces. The danger is that people may be trapped or buried amongst the debris or may collapse due to escaping gases and therefore they are not able to rescue themselves. What is needed in such situations are fire brigades, the THW, it is the German Federal Agency for Technical Relief or ambulances. But what are the dimensions of the disasters? and what kind of technical equipment is needed. Maps and construction plans available often are obsolete, so that problems may arise with the navigation of robots and rescue forces. For this reason, researchers of Fraunhofer are developing the project Seneca. This means a mobile robot sensor network for disaster management. In German, Sensornetzwerk mit mobilen Robotern für das Katastrophenmanagement. In the example scenario, this management receives the information that the industrial plant is on fire. The management sent out robots for the reconnaissance of the disaster area in order to get an overview of the damages. Mobile aerial robots fly to the disaster area to scan it with cameras and specific sensors they carry along. The aerial robots are networked with each other and by taking photos in flight they generate high resolution maps in 2D on the monitors of the disaster management. Specific sensors enable for rough localization of possible positions of victims or sources of danger. These positions are displayed on the monitors of the disaster control center. Image-guided and multi-sensor based methods support the quick detection of victims and further sources of danger. If there is a victim or a source of danger, underneath the debris the sensors identify it. As soon as the robot detects the victim, the robot transfers information to the disaster management and the rescue forces are called. 